I'm Miriam Leno, email copywriter. And look, there's relatively a new way of getting people's attention in your emails. Amy Potterfield and Marie Forleo have started to do this more often. They've sent emails within days of each other with this same exact tactic. And we've talked about the art, really, of using links in your emails to link it to something else, landing pages, sales pages, DSLs. But this time, we're talking about something a little bit different. And what am I referring to? Well, it's inserting GIFs or GIFs in your email that look like the thumbnail of a video so that when people click on it, it opens up the video itself. <laughs> this allows you to use video marketing as part of your campaign. And this is awesome because people will actually get to see you and hear directly from you, not through the words on the screen, but through a video of you. So when you use the right GIF, there's instant curiosity in your reader's mind. People are getting just a little bit, a very small glimpse of what they're gonna be watching when they click on it. People are really looking forward to it. And get this, using video is the best form of advertising. DSLs, webinars, tutorials, you name it. Video content is best to use when you really want to grab someone's attention and an email is a way to get you there. So take a look at these statistics below. Video commands more attention, so viewers are 1.4 more likely to watch video ads. That's a source that I will be sharing with you. 48% of people said that they are most likely going to be sharing a video with their friends more than any other content. And again, I will be sharing this with you as well. But this was very important. 88% of marketers have said that video marketing provides them with a positive ROI. And again, I will be sharing the source as well. So the question then becomes, how do we incorporate video in our emails? And while we love video, we need to link our video in our emails. So we don't have the capability to embed an actual video on our emails. So we need to get our subscribers to click on our GIF or image so that they're able to watch the video. So uh, we're being moving in the direction of actually embedding video in our emails, and I am sure it will be here soon, but it's not there yet. So the best way to do this is by having an image that moves like this, like this, like this, into the content of your email. It kind of looks like a video, but it's not. Now, let's not overdo it. Just use a couple of seconds and not more than that, maybe two or three. Just stay calm and don't go overboard by using too many of them. Just one is enough. But this is just a great practice to use. And sure, this practice has been around for a while, but just recently it's really picking up steam and more and more people are using this strategy because it works, because people get to click on that. And your subscribers are really getting engaged with your content. So try it for yourself and see what happens. Again, my name is Miriam Lenoff and I would love to be your copywriter for emails. If you have any questions, let me know and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.